Alright YouTube, I'll be showing you today how to downgrade your iOS firmware from 6.1.3 that currently does not have an untethered jailbreak out for it yet, uh, down to one that does. Uh, in this case I'll be going down to 5.1.1. Uh, to do this, what you'll need is Red Snow, uh, the IPSW of your choosing, whichever one you're going to down downgrade to, and you need the SHSH blob saved from that uh, firmware. Uh, to start, uh, I'm going to have to put this in DFU mode first, uh, just to make things simpler, so I'll do that right now. And uh, I have a video on doing this, so you can go check that out. There we go, and then just hold the home button. Until, there it goes. Alright, so coming to Red Snow, what you want to do is you want to go to Extras. You want to go to Even More. You want to click Restore. Uh, IPSW. Uh, select the one you're going to use. And... There we go. It's doing its stuff. Now this part takes a little while. Getting up there. Alright, now that long loading sequence that everyone loves. Alright, I'll check back with you guys when it's done. Alright, so it's been maybe three minutes or so. It looks like it's almost done. Checking. Alright, looks like it's been successfully restored. Now on boot up it should be 5.1.1. One. Now this is doing it all on on the iPods part. There's nothing nothing running on the computer. Alright, just the regular iPod setup. Uh, almost done. Gotta connect with iTunes real quick. Yeah, it's a pretty slow computer. Alright, 
like go on over to iPod. Come on. Here we go. Alright, just needed to connect with iTunes real quick. Then go to next. Agree, all that crap. Start using. And look at that. 5.1.1. Just to show you. There you go, right there. So that is how you downgrade from 6.1.3 to something that's jailbreakable.